Hello and welcome to Chili Bee Gaming. I'm Evie, this is Eddie, that's Lemon Pest in the background there on the right hand side. And today we're back with some more Starfield Shattered Space. And last time we were exploring this monastery that we randomly found after uh, visiting the Zealot Hideout. And now we're going to finish up exploring this and head back to uh, the Morning Device. So. Let's get into it. Ha ha! Yes, wonderful. Yeah, there's that hideout. That's where we were. All right, Lemon Pest. Let's take a little peep down here. Can we? Oh, there we go. Better get my better get my my weapon out. Anyone else? Anyone here? Huh. So there was a way in. I just couldn't bloody find it. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Does it? What? Is that blood or just dirt? I think it's just dirt. What's this? Endless Path of Wisdom 1. Ah, I see. Here we go. When the Great Serpent speaks, you must be ready to listen. But if you have not been seeking his signs, you will not be ready to hear him. Well, all right. They do like the fire, don't they? The fire and the candles. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Ah! So the way the way in was at the water? Hello? Anyone around here? Alright. Uh, okay. What the hell? Oh, oh. Container. Huh. Alright. Well, I think there's a few more things upstairs. A few more buildings, which we'll take a little peep in while we're, while we're here. Is it? Yep. Up here, this way. Just so we don't miss anything. Because it looked quite interesting from, um, from the Hello. bottom. Oh yeah, that's our robot. I forgot about that. Haha. Uh -huh. This Sorry. unit has been reprogrammed to serve the Great Serpent. Well, all right. I actually reprogrammed you to serve me, so if you're calling me the Great Serpent, I... Hmm. Could be a compliment. Could be quite a big compliment, that one. <laughs> hey. Never mind. All right, is there anything else here? Any of the goods? Hmm, I don't think there is, but it's always worth a peep just to see. What's this over here? Some other kind of pathway? Ah, you see, there is more to it. This way, up, up. Uh, okay, keep going. Oh, God. Okay, ah, and this is the Path of Wisdom 3. You fret that you cannot see him even though your eyes are open, but your eyes are not the only way to see him. Well, okay. Okay, fair, fair, fair enough. Hello. Lemon pet. see, gap there. Could have gone tumbling down. Down. What was that? Okay. <laughs> oh god, this is like the Was it the seven thousand yeah it was, it was the seven thousand steps in Skyrim, wasn't it? You climbed all the way to the top to see the greybeards. There you go, you see, look at this. Okay. Hello. You will I will suffer, will I? Just okay. How are we not doing any damage? Ah, is there a glass screen there? There's a glass screen there. All right, throwing your grenades. No need for that kind of violence. Alright. 
mean, this is quite, quite high. Okay, yep, yep. Wah! We alright, Lemon Pest? Oh, really? Let's, um... You're bruising me! Yep. Yep. Look out! We need your advice! <laughs> Go away! Honestly, so bloody rude, disturbing me when I'm looting! Are you alright, Lemon Pest? What? Oh, there you are. Well. Ow, it hurts. Well, it will! It's a bullet, you <laughs> fool! Honestly, you've got the brain of a cheese sandwich. And that's an insult to a cheese sandwich. Oh, hello. <laughs> Go! One more left. Where are they? In here? Hello? Yep, yep. Oh, you're up there, are you? Mm. Okay. I can kind of see what's what's going on here. In here? Hello? There you are. There we go. Perfect. Hey! So this is like the monast the monastery area. I have a groat pie. Anything else here? The upstairs, probably. Okay. Um. Well. Hey, look at this. A little kitchen area. Take that. Um. Cooking station. No. Holy, look at this! Getting absolutely sozzled. Do you know what, though? It's fine. Okay. Um, that's a little gross, but alright. Hmm. Well. Interesting. Very interesting. All right, let's see what they had out here first of all before I go wandering in there to finish the job. It's very high. What's this? Oh, just garbage. What did you have? Oh, I'll take that. Why not? Sand garden. Oh. Ah, Herald's room key. I will take it. Because we might find some nice goods. What's in here? Okay, yep. Uh, yep. 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 Targets. Okay. Some kind of shooting range. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <sighs> What is that noise? Uh, can I scan these? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What is that? Okay. Hmm. Anything else up here? Items of interest? No. Hmm. Well, alright. Shall I hop over to the other side first? Or should I check out this? Yeah, I'll go over the other side first. Let's just see what we can see over there. For some... What the... A tick turret. Why does it tick? All right. Well, there we are. There we go. Loving pest. Are you coming? <coughs> okay, there's a grenade. Jesus. It is. It is excessive, Loving pest. You are right. 
go. All right. Apparently there is now a turret shooting at me from um, a great distance. Ah. What? Oh, there you are. Okay. What are you head of ticking me for, love? Oh, there you are, are you? Whoa, sneaky. Alright. Let's reload. Herald's room key. Bloody hell! Herald just wanted people in his room, didn't he? Or, her, or she? She might have done. I don't know. All right. Uh, yeah. For some reason, I am un unable to. Oh no! There you go. That's fixed it. Couldn't crouch for a moment there. That's mildly irritating. So. There we go. Don't you knife lemon pest. Don't knife me either. Good God. They brought a knife to a gunfight. Stupid. Okay, I think that might be another turret. I'm not sure, though. Yeah, it is. There it is. Tick turret. Okay, right. Well, that was um, interesting. Very interesting. Set themselves up a kind of little area here. What have we got here? Tranquility Tea Chamomile. Really? That's a bulk item? I mean, okay. That's fine. Just a tale of two systems. I think we have that already. All right, let's peep up here first. Hello! And now you're dead. Oh, Let me guess. Turrets. And what it in. Yep. No turret. No signal for the turrets. Because we blew them up! Ah. Well, Lemon Pest. We, uh, we took them down. I'm glad we came over here first, you know? Because it just, it could have been a bit of a nightmare, I think, if we hadn't have done. Wow. Quite the view, though. Mm. Never mind, never mind. We must, must continue. They do have some very pretty plants here. Very pretty looking. Very nice. All right, I assume that um, we'll need these keys for something. Uh, no. I'm going to take the wine. Ah, here we are. Um... So, yes, Berserker Modified Refined Varun Long Fang. Ooh. Take that, that. Yep, take all of that, please. Thank you. Can we... Ooh. I quite like the look of that, actually. It might be a little bit like the... Um, what's it called that we always use? Okay. There we go. 
Hmm. It's weird, is it? Okay. This. <laughs> it might be like this, Lemon Pest. I can't remember the name of it now. Well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We're not here to remember names. We're here to take names. And apparently the Herald's room key. Although, where this Herald's room is, I have no idea. It must be in this building here. So let's cheese it on over and have a look. Find these last two Egypts and then... Um, Stake our claim. All right. Um, okay. Oh, that's a little disturbing. A groat's head. Okay, well. Hello? Anyone in? Bathroom, very nice. Very nice indeed, I'm sure. Very fancy bathroom. We could we could live up here, Lemon Pest. It's a little far to travel though. And it'd be a nightmare getting, you know, the shopping delivered. easy enough, wasn't it? <laughs> hey! Heal paste. Hmm. Yes, uh, I will take that, actually. Nikolai, Nickel C. Yeah. Ah. Alright, what's on here? Personal computer. Ooh. Message. What did you think today? Okay. 5.13. What did you think of the Herald's last sermon? I try to follow him, but I struggle to understand anything he says. Can you make sense of this? Reply, what did you think today? 7.38. The Herald is merely a conduit to better see the great serpent's teachings. You must exercise patience. Know that the answers lie within our grasp, even if just out of reach for now. But his arrival is imminent. Let a calmness wash over you as you become ready for his splendour. Listen to the herald, let him guide you to better understand your devotion. May the glory of the cosmos motivate you to prepare for the coming war. Ah. Oh. Well. We didn't really learn much there, but that's fine. They like this Nicholas Nicholson, Jesus. Uh, tranquility, Lotus and Earl Grey, Vars... Hmm. Okay. Yep. Desktop speakers. So. Oh. All right. Let's keep going. Going up. Going up. Going up. Door. Here we go. Cleaning. Cleaning room. Do that. Anything else? think the documentary about your life will be made into a movie? Tea. Hey. And who do you think will play me? I dread to imagine Lemon Pest. Good lord. Apparently the Herald's not here. Take those heretic writings. Herald's computer. Bizarre statuary. Harder times. Yes, we've read that one. Um, Alright, let's have a look at the safe first. And we're in! Marvellous. Um. Yes, 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 yes. Thank you. Okay, let's see. Sermons. Sermon 1. Infinite preparation for the endless war. When we stand before the great serpent as he resumes his role in the cosmos, will you be capable and sufficient for his needs or disposable and in our way? Do not waste your time on Varun Kai when you think have your mind and body to hone for the coming war. Think daily of his arrival, and these tasks will seem frivolous. You will become true and devoted. The Great Serpent is great. You cannot fathom his power, and yet we will witness it soon. We must prepare for eternity so that our victory will be endless. 
attack them with a storm of vengeance and dispel those who dis who oppose his will. Okay. Sermon 2. When the great serpent speaks. When the great serpent speaks, you must be ready to listen. But if you have not been seeking his signs, you will not be ready to hear him. In order to do what we must, we must be able to understand him. In order to understand him, to do his bidding, we must be willing. You worry you cannot see him, though your eyes are open, but to listen to his teachings, you need not see his being. You say that you cannot hear him, but that your eyes are open. There is not a problem with your eyes, but with your understanding. What do your eyes have to do with listening? You must go forward without doubt, and the path before you will become unobscured, unwinding as he reveals his secrets. Okay. Inventory and maintenance. No more sermons now. Restock. Package food, coza, bulk shipment, groat meat, vegetables, potatoes, carrots, onions, cabbage, celery, parsley, mushrooms, corn, high, new high-end rifles, discount supplier, additional books for enrichment. I would like to expand our exercise equipment, lounge chairs. To do this week, sweep, the pl sweep plazas and polish benches, rotate beverage in inventory, restock ammo and targets as shoot at shooting range, repair antennae at lookout post, Routine check on safety rails, clear rubble from trail, clean rifle barrels and replace parts. Ha! Huh. Well, alright. It seems a little... Odd, but fine. Okay. Lives at the top of a giant pyramid. Okay, well. We came, we saw, we... You know, did the do as you do, what you do, when you do, and now it's time to um, get out. Right, we need to get back to the Rev 8 and um, then return to Dazra. Yes, indeed, we do. All What's right. Next on the agenda saving the world, saving the galaxy. Oh, Lord, do you have anything in saving... interesting for me? Indeed. I thought it might compliment your indomitable spirit. Okay. Miso soup. There's just nothing in there, is there? Nothing behind those eyes. Good Back lord. Back to work, then. Yes, come on, Lemon Pest. Bloody hell. I don't know. What's he like? A pain. But... Could we possibly... Stuff in here? Just as a th thought. Hello. Do let me know if anything has caught your eye. Can I? Yep. I was hoping you would eventually stumble into my shop. Welcome. Well, thanks. Um. You were actually hoping to meet me? I mean, I get it. You know, glorious that I am. Go on. Well, yes. I realize others might treat people such as yourself with skepticism and distrust, but my opinions differ. No. You've clearly been chosen by the Great Serpent, sent here to help us in our time of need. In my mind, to treat you with anything but respect would be ignorant. Oh, well, that's, yeah, that's nice, actually. What an unusually friendly greeting. Hmm? Oh, yes. I imagine it's been difficult for you. It's rare that an off-worlder finds their way to Dasra. But not just any off-worlder. One that's able to speak with a Nazgul Varun himself. Which in the eyes of the citizens of Dasra moves you up from the suspiciously curious category to the dangerously unique one. Oh. Well, um... Well, you clearly know who I am. But I don't know who you are. Where are my manners? I'm Nalata Brady. Forgive me for not starting our conversation that way. I've been a, a bit distracted of late. Yeah. My brother Kwasim has been missing for days. Oh. I'm beginning to worry that something terrible has happened to him. Um. Hmm. Yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. It's kind of poopy. Yes. Thank you. But my problems need not burden you. If you want to take a look at what my shop has to offer, well, you let me know. 
I mean, perhaps I could help you locate him. Really? Yeah. You do that for me? Oh, you truly are a gift from the Great Serpent. I knew he hadn't forsaken us. Um, hmm. Well. Yeah, don't get too excited. I, I mean, I can't make any guarantees. Of course. But the mere fact that you'd even spend the time is more reassuring than just standing here waiting for his return. The last time I heard from Kwasim, he was headed out to the Deep Gorge refinery to assess if it could be reopened. Oh. He never came back that evening. I've been worried sick. Well, I'll, um, I'll see what I can do. That's all that I would ever ask. Okay. Just please be careful. That old refinery has been abandoned for years, and there's no telling what might be choosing to call the facility its home. Yeah, true. Now, is there anything you might need for your journey? Let's, uh, let's take a look, shall we? In All right, let's go and, um... Oh, the, the, um, what are they called? What? Oh, there it is. Tuh. Okay, so, this dude over here. If you require aid, Hanton Irara at the oh. Halls of Healing may be able to assist you, if she can spare the supplies. Well, I'm all right for now. Um, ah, there we go. Probably out oh, look ridiculous. I wonder if your boots need polishing. No, they're fine, Lemon Pest. Thank you. So, oh, there. How do we? Do we go up this thing? I think we do. What is that noise? God bless it. Creeping me out. Sounds like. Feet walking on the floor like creatures' feet. Ugh. Stinky. Oh, there you are, are you? I do not understand. <gasps> I saw a Naspo. Took measure of his burdens. Oh, dear. What you are describing is a dream. Nothing more. Not a dream. A message oh. from the great serpent himself. With all due respect to your craft, dear sister, now is not the time for incense and ash leaves. Or do you not see the depth of the crater before you? Well, on the contrary, brother. I see it for what it truly is. And if we ignore this vision, Anesco will be lost to us forever. Enough with the proselytizing. The Vindicator has returned. Yes, I bloody well have. Were you able to find Sahima? Yes, I was. I was able to get Sahima's research as well. Perfect. I have no doubt Sahima's work is the key to stabilizing the morning device. If only the others had listened to her, we may not have lost so much of our great city. Well... This leaves houses Dulkef and Vathol. Politics can wait. Every moment we delay, Anasco descends further into the void. For the last time, Faith will not remove the barrier. Science will. It is the hubris of science that failed you in this moment. Oh dear. We reached out to the Great Serpent. This is his reply. You claim he has forsaken us? I do no such thing. The Great Serpent's reply is not an answer, but a question. Are we worthy of his grace? Until that is proven. Your works will not succeed. Well... <sighs> yeah, you're both right. We must have faith that our efforts will work. We've got to believe it'll work. But without the science, we're screwed. There it is. It sounds like you agree with me. And yet, only one is the foundation for the other. But the proof is not in our words. It is in the vision. Anasco's presence still persists in this world. And he seeks our aid. Eh, fine. I feel like I've lived this argument a thousand times. And the only way to move past it is to concede to its nonsense. Vindicator, speak to my sister. 
agree to her fool's errand oh, so that God. we may continue the work of saving this city. Okay, you, you gave me a weapon, that's nice. Um, your life, your purpose has been forever changed. Well, all right, let's have a discussion. I have seen then. visions of Anesco searching for one bold enough to enter the heart of the vortex. And now that you are here, I know your arrival was no accident, but rather providence. Um, Providence. The Great Serpent has guided you here. From the moment you found the Oracle to the words I speak to you now. Um... Well, I don't know about that. I don't even know what that means. Worry not. Understanding <clears throat> is not given to those who lack the Herald's eye. But rest assured, all will be revealed when you journey north. At the edge of the crater, you will find a cave carved by the anomaly. There, you will make contact with a Nasco Varun. Um, you sound certain I'll find him there. It is as the Great Serpent foretold. In my visions, I witnessed two futures. In the first, you breached the scaled citadel, but found Anasco had sunk too far into the void. And in time, all of Dazra was consumed along with him. Um... Sounds a little ominous. Indeed. But there is another path. In the second future, I saw you make contact with Anasco, entering a cave through a formless wall. At its terminus was a gate, a path into the realm where our speaker resides. You stepped into this void, and in that moment, something changed. The false future Rewritten. Uh, roughly speaking, it could be that entering the Vortex directly would allow you to speak with him. And while my readings do not show any anomalous activity, I admit there's a lot of interference. Still, that only emphasizes the potential danger involved here. I cannot approve of such an excursion on the minute chance Anasco is present. Hmm. Uh... I would be able to speak to Anasco? Not in the way you and I speak, but in crude terms, yes. Provided you manage to maintain your own sanity through the process. But this is all purely theoretical. No one has ever entered the Vortex and come back. Um... Yeah, what kind of danger are we talking about here? The closer one ventures to the heart of the Anomaly, the closer they are to the phantoms and horrors that lie within. Moreover, if this cave was cut open by the Calamity itself, then it is an unnatural formation and highly unstable. Well... You just need to have a little faith. If not in your great serpent god, in me. I am no heretic, but to risk so much on a vision... <laughs> it is a leap of faith I cannot condone. I will not stand in your way, however, as Inaza has stood in ours. You may not realize it now, dear brother, but our goals are one and the same. Well, oh... If you point me to the cave, I can find him. Then you must embark to the northern edge of the crater. You will find an entrance there, one that has no form. Step through it, find Anasco, and complete the vision. Only then will his voice be heard. Well, all right. Jeez, lemon pest. Like a... Like a bloody peeping Tom down there. You strange little man. Oh, Lord. Right, so... We now have to go to some kind of cave. 
But should we help the other families first? Is that what we should do? Maybe, I suppose. Mm. Is that the idea, the plan? Um, aligning the houses. Oh, those are my options. Okay. The duel, that's still going on. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I never picked up my reward from Thingy Shack, did I? Oh, bottoms. Well, oh. do you know what? Whatever. So, down here? Okay, come on then, Lemon Pest. Let's, um, just oh, be careful. Um. Uh, okay, I'm assuming that we just yeah. Okay, maybe we have to go up. Oh God. Um. Round this way. What the hell? Okay, this, 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 this is, this is, this is no good. I need to get out of this bubble so that I can actually. Really? I'm not worried about you, Lemon Pest. Never am I ever worried about you. Because nine times out of ten, you're usually all right. Unforgiving sex phantom. Hey now. Chill out. There. Um Okay. Oh god. Come in, Lemon Pest, just give me a minute. Okay. Well, that was um, awful, wasn't it? But, yeah. Oh. What, the, what am I stuck on? Jesus. Okay. Yep. Yep. And yep. Where have they got... Oh. Hmm. Maybe we're alone out here. We are not alone, Just Lemon Pest. We are not alone. Me. I can assure you, we are not alone. We haven't been alone for a... Okay. For a long time. Where... Where... Where are these Egypts? Oh. somewhere here. Oh! Well, that's very annoying, isn't it? Just keep running away. Don't run away. It's rude. I know there's one up here, so we might as well... Yep, yep, yep. Oh, there we go. So 
where is this last one? Directly in front of us, apparently. Hopeless vortex phantom. Alright, vortex shard. Bloody hell! There we go. Good God! Where are they all coming from, for crying out loud? Ow! Stop that! It's irritating. Yep, yeah, uh, yep. Yeah. Oh, hey, look at this. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. It's just what the doctor ordered. Yeah. Yeah. Lemon Pest, are you alright? What? Okay. What? Now you're just playing silly beggars. Right. That's that. Done and dusted. Brilliant. In fact, I want that. Okay. I want the vortex shard, please. Thank you. Right. Okay, well, here's the cave, Lemon Pest. Here is the cave. Look at this. Actually quite pretty in, um, wow, in the right light. Look at that. Can we... No. Never mind, never mind, eh? Never mind, look at that. But we are going to leave it there for today, folks. Next time we will head into the cave and um, see if we can speak to Anasco. So until next time, be safe, be good, and look after yourselves.